The IRS's annual filing season program, known as the AFSP, is a voluntary program designed to recognize the efforts of non-credentialed tax return preparers who increase their knowledge through continuing education. By meeting specific requirements, return preparers can earn a record of completion from the IRS and be listed in a public database of return preparers. Remember, at this point, the program is completely voluntary. There are two key benefits for participating in the AFSP. The first of which is the inclusion in the IRS's Directory of Tax Return Preparers with Credentials and Select Qualification, which is a searchable, sortable listing designed to help taxpayers find a tax return preparer that carries their preferred credentials or qualifications. It includes information about all attorneys, CPAs, enrolled agents, enrolled retirement plan agents, and enrolled actuaries with valid PTINs. The directory also includes information on individuals who receive the AFSP Record of Completion. In addition, participants in the AFSP have certain representation rights before the IRS. Beginning in 2016, return preparers who are not attorneys, CPAs, or enrolled agents and did not participate in the AFSP were only permitted to prepare tax returns and not represent clients before the IRS. Return preparers who earn the AFSP record of completion have limited representation rights. They can represent clients whose returns they prepared and signed, but only involving initial audits, customer service matters, and before the Taxpayer Advocate Service. Return preparers must be an AFSP participant both in the year of return preparation and the year of representation. To earn an AFSP record of completion for the upcoming filing season, preparers must complete the annual federal tax refresher course or after course by December 31st, unless they are exempt. This course is available on drakecpe.com. In addition to the after course, participants must earn specified continuing education credits by December 31st, including 10 federal tax law credits and two ethics credits for a total of 18 credits. Consent to adhere to certain obligations in Circular 230, and participants must obtain or renew a PTIN before signing the Circular 230 consent. There are some preparers who may be exempt from the after course requirements, but still must complete a total of 15 hours of CPE credit. After a tax return preparer meets all the requirements, the IRS will issue a certificate or record of completion. The after course with exam and all CE credits must be completed annually by December 31st prior to the start of tax season. Drake Software is here to help you earn the AFSP Record of Completion. We are committed to providing all required continuing education for any tax return preparer who wants to earn his or her Record of Completion through the Annual Filing Season Program. As an IRS-approved CPE provider, Drake has been authorized by the IRS to offer the after course and exam and it's available on our website, drakecpe.com. In addition to the after course, there is a host of courses available to help you meet the education requirements. To learn more about who is exempt, CPE credits needed, and more, please visit drakesoftware.com AFSP.